Episode 17, The Truth of the Car Accident Comes to Light, Chen Jujun ran to Min Hui and asked Min Hui how Su Tian died in the car accident. He and his sister were sent to the orphanage at the same time, and later he was adopted. After growing up, Chen Jujun has been looking for Su Tian, someone told him that Min Hui and Su Tian were together when the car accident happened. At the moment of life and death, they pushed and shoved. Chen Jujun believed that Min Hui killed his sister. At this time, Exian Chi's questioning eyes were so familiar, Min Hui was very sad, and asked Exian Chi if she also suspected that she had harmed Su Tian. Chao Mu saw the group photo of Chen Jujun and Su Tian accidentally left on the table. She was surprised that the two were siblings, so she hurried to Min Hui's house, wanting to tell her about this shocking big melon. But Chao Mu was very surprised when he saw that the three people in the room were very angry. He had never seen Min Hui so excited. Chao Mu piled Min Hui behind his body and scolded Xian Chi for being unkind. The two of them have been together for so long and also doubted Min Hui's character. Min Hui thought for a while, not wanting Chen Jujun to believe that his sister was killed. In order to prevent him from spending the rest of his life in the shadows, Min Hui decided to take Xian Qi and Chen Jujun to Shiquan Town. What happened in Shiquan Town, she wanted to take them to prove her innocence. Yao Zizhu found the address of Zhou Ruji's house through her own relationship and brought ingredients to his house to have a meal in advance. After receiving a call from Chao Mu, there was no one to take care of her. Zhou Ruji immediately prepared to go to Min Hui's house to take care of her, and Yao Zizhu followed went. Min Hui found the witnesses at the scene of the car accident, the passenger who was sitting on the bus at the same time that day. She only remembered the appearance of the passenger, but not the name of the other person. Fortunately, Xian Chi kept the news photos of the car accident and threw these in the photo, Min Hui locked onto a person who was in the car at the time. Zhou Ruji took Yao Zizhu to take care of Quan Quan. Quan Quan liked this sister very much and praised her for her dancing. Take care of it, Min Hui, Xian Qi, and Chen Jujun found witnesses together. At that time, the bus suddenly lost control and rushed to a field ridge. The people in the bus were in a mess. Min Hui desperately tried to reach Su Tian who had fallen. He pulled Min Hui out of the car, and the moment Min Hui got out of the car, the car rolled down the field ridge, and Su Tian died inside, in fact, Su Tian had a chance of surviving but the car was driven violently, and her wallet fell to the ground. There was a photo of her younger brother in it. In order to get the photo, Su Tian missed the best chance to escape, so Yin and Yang were separated. Chen Jujun apologized to Min Hui. Although he already knew the result, after learning the details, he still burst into tears. He didn't expect his own sister to end her young life so hastily. Min Hui sympathized with Chen Jiajun's feelings. She asked Chen Jiajun if he could treat her as his sister, and Chen Jiajun's eyes were full of gratitude. Yao Zizhu made no secret of her liking for Zhou Ruji. That night she knew that the girl Zhou Ruji had been secretly in love with was Min Hui, and she couldn't help but feel a little sad. On the way back, the taxi driver accidentally said, women chase men. Before waiting for the result, Yao Zizhu did not give up her pursuit of Zhou Ruji. Xian Qi knew that he had misunderstood Min Hui again, and the two had a disagreement again. Now that the truth had been clarified, Min Hui quietly left the hotel early in the morning. Xian Qi and Chen Jujun came back to the orphanage where the siblings lived, and asked the dean to tell them about Su Tian again. Xian Qi has been donating money to this orphanage for many years. The dean was very happy to see Xian Qi himself at last. He couldn't help revealing that a girl came to ask her about Su Tian's story in the morning. Xian Qi thought of this the person must be Min Hui, so I ran to find Min Hui immediately.